Hello everyone, this is Matt from Nadelco Woodworks and today I want to show you the solution to this puzzle. It's a 4x4x4 four by four by four cube puzzle and the design is by Stuart Coffin. It's called Involute. And um, this is kind of like a Rubik's Cube if you uh, if you're familiar with that, but it doesn't spin like a, a Rubik's Cube and, it, and it's an interlocking puzzle so um, the moves, uh, the pieces come apart in linear motions. Um, the first thing that you need to do is find the key piece, and you know you could spend quite a while looking around trying to find the the key, but I know that it's right here, and it's uh, contrary to what you're prone to do. You're trying to push these pieces usually. This one comes out with a, a lift, so you lift that part out. Then the next part, it, it slides uh, over, like so. That then allows you to take uh, a piece out right from here. So now we have two of the pieces disassembled. And then the, uh, this part will slide right, right out as well. Now you can see we're, we're starting to get somewhere here. Now the next part requires a rotation and a coordinated motion. So you see this piece here, it kind of it, it needs to rotate. You can't lift it out because it's being locked in by this guy. So if you rotate it and move this one out at the same time, should be able to get these these out just like that. You get it to the point where you can lift it away, and that part comes out. Now we're getting pretty close. This this piece lifts out. Then you've only got two pieces left, and they just separate like so. So there you go. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight pieces in this puzzle. There they all are. Now to put them back together again, see what that looks like. One and two go together like that. This piece fits in right here. Now for our coordinated motion one, we know that it's gonna sit in like so. And this piece here needs to slide in up front. There, there it is. Now we're going to put this piece in, slide it forward. This, uh, sorry, this piece goes in like that, slide it back, and the key piece goes in on top. There you go. Thank you very much, everybody, for watching. Hope that that helps.